continue to live in their own homes and communities. So this is about people staying in their own homes, not needing to go uh, further afield for goods or for services or for any sort of uh, community service that's available to everybody else. And just to say, first of all, I see the questions have been very much linked because I think it's not like just you wanting an isolation, it's about yes. understanding the overall issues. Um, I suppose one of the major things is in relation to funding and advocating for increased funding for the disability sector. The first thing we have to do is restore, there, there was a massive push, it went from 1.53 billion to 1.4 billion from 2013 to 2014 in the budget. So we need to look at restoring um, that funding and increasing, like one of the things we're proposing is to increase the um, respite care allowance, which so many people really rely on. But I think, from a, from a personal point of view, what we need to do is consult with people who are uh, users of disability services and who work in the disability sector and find out exactly how we can help, like comes meetings like tonight and, and different organisations, and then campaigning for increased funding. Um, but not just that, like we need to start sort of from the ground up, like in terms of child, uh, child care. What we want to see as well is um, more access to you know, the free preschool year. It's very difficult for a lot of children with disabilities to get access to the free preschool year. And then you go into the education system, it's very difficult if you have any learning difficulties to get a, an assessment. A lot of people are forced to pay for that privately. I have experience of that with my own son. And then special needs assistance, everything is a battle. And that's what it feels like. I think, you know, it's a, everything is a battle to fight for everything, fight to access to public transport, for education, for employment. So what we need to do is look at it in a whole and not just like, that's what I'm saying, it's, the questions are kind of linked, but it's about increasing funding and consulting with people who are in that reality every day and saying to them, what way can we improve this? And that's, that's key to it. There's a lack of consultation in a lot of ways. So just to, to make that point. Lovely.